Good morning. Today is my second to last day of classes ever, and I'm not going because today is also the second day in a row I had to call AAA. The guy yesterday said that my battery is old, so that's probably the issue. I'm just paying to get a new one at this point. Like, I thought maybe it would last until I was done with school. No. At this point, I could technically just, like, walk to class, but... I already called AAA, they're gonna be here in a little while. Maybe I'll just show up, like, really late to class. I don't think he's gonna be happy about that, but... Well, so, when I was messing with it the first time, a helpful bro guy knocked on my window. I couldn't roll the window down because, like, you know couldn't get my car started but I opened the door for him and he said it was my battery which I already knew but I appreciate you helpful bro guy I don't know if you actually are a bro guy I just kind of assume that most guys in college are bro guys it's really hot in my car um <laughs> I am gonna open the door I just don't want to do it while I'm talking to myself you know today's um there's probably gonna be the hottest day so far this year so this is unfortunate Yesterday was, like, the second hottest day. Yesterday got to, like, high 80s. I remember yesterday, I didn't have class or anything yesterday. I just wanted to go to the store. Um, I remember thinking, like, well, I guess it's good that I did this before my 8.30 class on Thursday. So I'm not just sitting here, and it happened again. I guess, because I don't know when he's coming, I guess I'm just going to talk about some stuff that's been on my mind. Um, but I can't think of anything right now because I'm really tired. I could feel a headache coming up, coming on at about, like, 10.30 last night, something like that. We go to bed really early in my dorm room. So, I took two ibuprofen, woke up with a splitting headache at, like, 2 in the morning, and then I couldn't get back to sleep for, like, an hour. And I think the dark circles under my eyes are looking better now. They looked really bad when I woke up. Oh, and in case you're wondering, I took more ibuprofen. Can you overdose on ibuprofen? Probably. Oh, my God. I have to open the door. It's really hot. I'm gonna get in so much trouble for missing class. I mean, I guess maybe it would have been smart to not call AAA until after my class was over, but it's too late now. I mean, I guess all things considering, I'm getting what I deserve. I've been trashing my car for a very long time now. And I know most of it's my fault. Uh, <laughs> the exhaust pipe is completely rusted through. See, look. The worst thing about sitting here with my door slightly ajar is the fact that people keep thinking I'm about to leave and they keep just like lingering behind me. Between that and that guy that knocked on my window, this is more so Cylinder X and then I've had all year. I heard someone coming. Aside from this complete and utter garbage, I've also been running inside like every five minutes to go to the bathroom. Do you think it might be the E. coli? I don't remember the last time I ate lettuce. Maybe it was in like a sandwich I ate or something. Okay, I just googled the symptoms. I don't have vomiting. I don't have severe cramps, so I'm probably fine. But it also said that symptoms could appear like a week after you eat lettuce, which is probably the case. So there's always a chance um, that this will kill me. And honestly, life is too short to sit in this car. I don't even know why I'm stuck. All right, nature. This is great. This is better. I want to go home. Hey, good news. I got a new battery. And my class ends in 15 minutes. I'm not even going to bother. I'm going to walk in just as it's ending. And he's going to be like, where the fuck were you? Sitting in a parking lot for an hour and a half. Where do you think I was? <laughs> All right. Uh, bye. I don't know how to end things. Just... Have a good day, I guess. Have a better day than I have.